Hey what's going on guys this is Kedar here and today in this video on social security we have got 8 things about social security's cost of living adjustment increase that you need to know and you know social security covers wide range of beneficiaries including SSI, SSDI, VA, people on retirement, disability, people on fixed income, low income and underneath the social security radar about 70 million social security beneficiaries will get impacted by the latest cost of living adjustment and here are eight things that you need to know about the social security's cost of living adjustment everything in favor of social security beneficiaries raises benefits and all that so before we start this video make sure to check out other videos from our channel recently we have done fourth stimulus check $1,400 update for social security recipients and also apart from 8.7% cost of living adjustment we have got $200 social security raise in the 2023 so do check out these videos right over here we upload new videos every single day so make sure to subscribe to our channel with bell notification turn on this will keep you up to date on latest videos like this we do compile lots of financial details in short videos like this so do check out thousands of videos on our channel and without further ado let's get right into the video so this week social security administration announced 8.7 percent cost of living adjustment increase which is the highest cost of living adjustment increase in last 40 years on october 13th we have got the data from the Social Security Administration regarding the latest cost of living adjustment. And based on the latest data that we got, there are a couple of changes. So let's cover eight most important details that will impact the payments for Social Security beneficiaries. So here are the eight things that you need to know about this cost of living adjustment increase formerly known as COLA. So starting with the first important point, well all this cost of living adjustment announcement, what they have announced, all these changes in the latest cost of living adjustment will be implemented on January 1st, 2023. Recently I saw a lot of people commenting that when we are actually going to receive this cost of living adjustment increases and that's the answer on January 1st, 2023 all the changes will take place immediately and usually the first payment that will go out in the January will have an additional cost of living adjustment figure added into the current monthly social security payments and this change is impacting all the social security beneficiaries underneath the social security radar so about 70 million beneficiaries and that covers SSI, SSDI, retirees and pretty much everyone. Now coming over to the second most important point that is the cost of of living adjustment for the 2023 will be 8.7 percent according to the social security administration and by the way this one is the largest increase since last 41 years and social security beneficiaries will see a significant increase in more than four decades and here you can check since 1975 we have received about four times the highest cost of living adjustment in 1979 9.9 percent .9 right up to that 14.3 percent and in 1981 11.2 percent and again in 1982 7.44% and right after that there is not a lot like 2.5 to 5% increase right there and coming over to the latest January 2023 we are receiving 8.7% cost of living adjustment and coming over to the third important point that is does this cost of living adjustment cover those people on SSI and social security disability well the answer is yes definitely it covers all those recipient under need the social security radar in fact it covers people with social security that is SSI social security disability VA retirement disability retirees survivors people on fixed income low income pretty much everyone underneath the social security radar these cost of link adjustment are the changes applied for all those recipients and coming over to the fourth important point the average increase are substantial I mean the maximum federal SSI benefit for individuals will jump to $914 per month as per the latest 2023 cost of living adjustment. In the last year, we have the standard federal SSI payment was only $841 for the individuals and speaking of the maximum SSI benefit for couples, it will be $1,371 which is up from current year's value that is $1,261 and this cost of living adjustment are yearly adjustment. These are basically the adjustment that will take place and once you get an cost of living adjustment in next 
year you get more next year you get even more ads on top of that so it's definitely a benefit for all the beneficiaries so for ssi federal standard payment for individuals it will be 914 dollars a month and for couples it will be 1371 dollars per month as of latest cost of living adjustment in the 2023 coming over to the fifth important point how will you actually know your specific increase well sometimes in the december you should receive a letter from social security detailing all the new details on the benefits for the latest cost of living adjustment in the 2023 coming over to the next important point and it goes like this you might end up paying more taxes that's because in 1984 congress created this thresholds for wealthier social security recipients to pay taxes on their benefits and the most important thing is since that time those thresholds have not been updated since their creation in the 1984s and the inflation is making it easier for you to move in those kind of a tax brackets and when you do move into those tax brackets your benefits can be taxable for up to 50 percent going all the way up to 85 percent of your taxable income so check your tax preparer regarding the impact and here are the threshold just 25,000 in income for individuals and 32,000 for couples so these are the thresholds after you cross this income levels your social security benefits are also taxable and we are talking about 50 percent to 85 percent benefits that can be taxable moving over to the next important point that is medicare part b premiums could be impacted and you know medicare part b premiums are directly deducted from your social security monthly checks and it is expected that in the year 2023 the medicare part b premium could actually decrease for the first time in the long history actually and medicare part b premiums are on the verge to decrease by about three percent so right there from $170.10 we are talking about $164 Medicare Part B premiums in the year 2023. I mean not a lot of decrease in the medicare part b premiums but definitely it could have been much worse since the inflation increasing by a lot but the good thing is the medicare part b premium hasn't been increased that's a great relief and coming over to the next point that is the annual cost of living adjustment that is cola increases for the social security benefits are not based on the inflation of the goods and services instead these changes are based on the parameter that SSA looks at and SSA takes in consideration for the consumer price index for urban wage earners and clerical workers and a quick fact the CPI data is launched by Bureau of Labor Statistics and even though urban wage earners likely to have higher costs as they have more traveling costs, commute costs and other things like that so that will likely benefit most of the social security beneficiaries as you may know the cost related to social security beneficiaries regarding the travel and other things like that are not much but there is a other report suggesting that that is with the latest social security expansion act introduced on June 9th by US Republican Peter DiPazio and US Senator Bernie Sanders, this new bill would implement a new CPI figure for calculating the cost of living adjustment. So instead of the CPIW, which is Consumer Price Index for Urban Wage Earners and Clerical Workers, instead they will take in account CPIE, which is Consumer Price Index for Elderly. So this one is specifically designed for elderly group of individuals, but this change will take in effect if this bill will get passed in the congress and most of these changes are in favor with the social security beneficiaries pretty much all of them actually if you found this video helpful make sure to hit that like and do check out other videos related to fourth stimulus check for 1400 dollars for social security beneficiaries and apart from the 8.7 percent cost of doing adjustment there is a latest social security 200 dollars raise in the 2023 so do check that videos on our channel and make sure to subscribe to our channel as we upload new videos every single day so make sure to turn on this bell notification icon so that will keep you up to date on latest videos on our channel and thank you so much for watching this video till then and this is kedar from how to guys signing out